Hi everyone. So we're learning Shar HaBatachan with Chassidus in order to live with the Geula, to bring the Geula. So at the, in the introduction to the Sefer that Chayinu put out on Shar HaBatachan with Hasidic commentary on it, the author of the of the compilation, not the author of Shar Batachan is Rabinu Bachaya ben Pakuda. But Chayinu put out this book that compiles it with some Chassidus, which is so amazing. So in the intro to this sefer that was put out by Chayinu, it's explaining that Chassidus enables us to understand the mechanisms of Batachan. So Batachan was obviously always foundational to Yiddishkeit, to living a, living as a servant of Hashem. Actually, Rabino Bachaya opens up Shar Batachan in the very beginning, saying that trusting in Hashem is the most important thing in serving Hashem. Let me repeat that. Trusting in Hashem is the most important thing in serving Hashem. That's how Shar Batachan starts out, which is a pretty bold statement. And as you learn about it more, you'll, you'll, you'll see why. It literally affects everything. But, um, but Hasidus really helps us do it on a whole new level. So what does it say in the Tanya? What does it say? It says that when something negative occurs in this world, right? No one should know of anything negative. But when something negative occurs in this world, it says that it's actually coming from the hidden worlds. And that it's such a highlight that when it descends into this world, if this world's not a fit vessel for it, 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 it causes it to manifest in a negative way. It's like almost like, think of it almost like as a shattering. Like this world wasn't a fit vessel for this light, so it caused a shattering. And that manifests in a way that appears very negative to us, okay? But we know that Hashem is good, and there's nothing but Hashem. So everything is essentially good. The question is, what level of good is it? And the altar explains in the Tanya that negative things actually are a higher good. They come from a higher place. So when we meditate on that, and we, when we use our conscious faculties to meditate and consciously realize that negative occurrences really have a really high source, it causes it to turn around. Why? Because we just created the vessel that now that light like, can manifest in this world in a, in a positive way. Because we used our conscious faculties to meditate, we, cre- we created the, the, that, that which was missing in the first place. It's, it's, it's an amazing idea. The batachan itself is what, what rectifies. It's a very powerful medication, if you want to think about it like that. It's not like we trust and then Hashem's like, okay, they trusted enough, now I'm going to turn it around. You could say it like that, but it's not actually the mechanism. The mechanism is that Hashem implanted within our souls the ability to go so deep in our souls, to, to trust Hashem so deeply that we then cause the situation to turn around. From that, from that place of trust. And I, I think this is also one of the things that the, the Rebbe means when he says that the Jewish people are so powerful. We literally have the ability to make miracles because we're one with God. So what I want to say about this in connection with the Ge'ul Shlema is that the Rebbe says in Tazriya Matsara to Sicha from the year Nun Aleph that Gullus itself is really just a highlight, which is thematic of like those sikhas, Achrimas, Achrimas Kadoshim, Tazriya Matsara, Amar, where the Rebbe keeps saying, we're not doing away with the Gullus, we're just transforming it. That Gullus itself is just a high light of Hashem. And so the Rebbe says over there, so how do we create a vessel so that this high light can manifest in Geula in a positive way, not in this Shvira Sakilam or whatever we would call Gullus, right? And so the Rebbe says through learning, through using our conscious faculties, the more that we meditate on these concepts, the more we actually create the vessel that it should be manifesting in a positive way. So we're very powerful. Let's do this together and let's cause the Gula Shlema now.